in studio with us. After spending the day on the road with a driving expert, well, Kylie, what did you learn? Well, Doug Sonia, think about this. A vehicle weighs more or less than 2,000 pounds. Now, I can't even imagine not stopping at that crosswalk to let them walk across. That's why NWA Driving School President says that drivers should listen closely. We are truly in need of more widespread, uh, good driver education. Kemma Harper is the president of NWA Driving Academy. She says as an instructor, she just wants to help drivers make safe and smart decisions on the road. I believe a good education can make a huge difference. Um, just recently, uh, the statistics came out, Arkansas ranks second in the nation for the number of motor vehicle fatalities for teen drivers. And the reason it's so high is probably not obvious to most drivers who probably don't notice. But for pedestrians, it's crystal clear. I bet if we had time to just sit in an intersection where there's a crosswalk and a stop sign or a stop line, we would have probably observed, I would guess, 85 to 90 percent of drivers just drive right over the stop line and pedestrian crosswalk and they stop the first time where they can see. Now she preaches the importance of keeping your eyes and your mind on the road. This applies to both drivers and pedestrians. I just thought, oh, I'm looking for a little old lady that wants to cross the street. She's just going to be standing there waiting for me and I have to stop for her. But now I understand I am not just searching for a person standing there. I am to search for a kid, an adult coming fast on a bicycle. So she has some advice for drivers before you put your car into drive. If you search from garage door to garage door, like sweep, excuse me, sweep back and forth, you're more likely to identify a kid coming out of a garage on a skateboard, a bicycle, a kid running after their dog or a ball, um, a car backing out of the garage. There's so much more that you're more likely to see by broadening your scope. So sweep, just a visual sweep from garage door to garage door. And this is what it should look like. Most of the time, nothing happens. Nobody gets hurt. But it's the one time that a kid did come on a bicycle or a, a, a person jogging, a lady jogging, and gets hit. Then they call it the A word. And with the spike in pedestrian and vehicle collisions, Harper says we refer to them as accidents. But she believes that shouldn't be the case, since most accidents can be avoided. And by learning how to drive safely, we can ensure our Kansans arrive home alive. Now, with the rise in pedestrian accidents, drivers should be more careful, and pedestrians are encouraged to know their surroundings. Both parties can help decrease the rate of incidents across northwest Arkansas and into the River Valley. Reporting in studio, Kylie Neal, KNWA, Northwest Arkansas News.